Everybody, welcome back to Impressionable Gaming. I know, I know, you deserve an explanation. It's been a couple days since the Twitch leak went live and everybody saw it. And I gotta say, I'm a little embarrassed, you know. I mean, it's... It's been a challenge trying to hide all the money that I get. And you know what? It's not that much. I mean, look. XQC is in a close second, you know, he's a formidable opponent. It's just how it is, guys. You all brought me to where I am today, and I really, really appreciate it. I've been able to meet a lot of really cool people, um, XQC being one of them, Moist Critical, Alinity, Mizkiff, Ludwig, all wonderful people. And, you know, they're all working very hard as well. Not as hard as you all. I mean, <laughs> working a normal job. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of, kind of cringe. But, you know, I, I'm just messing with you guys. You know, it's, it's not that big of a deal. So what if I have, like, ten Lamborghinis and a giant three-story mansion with my own extended library and an in-ground pool with a pet gorilla. Like, it's not that big of a deal, all right, you know? And this is the smallest room in the house. This was actually a closet that I used for soundproofing and turned it into this little office here. So, I mean, you know, it's, it's fun living out here in the hills. But you know what I like more than my Lamborghinis? Knowledge. On a more serious note though, guys, I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. There are so many people out there getting upset and angry, and I, I don't know why. They're, they get angry at their, their favorite streamers. Why? Because they're successful. What did you expect? We've all known since PewDiePie took over the internet on YouTube, we all knew, what, what did you expect? Do you expect he lived in a shack somewhere with Marcia? No, it's not, we knew from the beginning that online influencers made good revenue from their ads and from their sponsors and just from the hard work that they do. And for you to be upset about that is kind of crazy and surprising, honestly. I mean, you all have been supporting these streamers for a long time. Uh, many of you uh, subbed for years since they started and everything. And you've seen them grow. You know they have a fan base. You know there's plenty of donations. I mean, even sitting in their streams just for their donations and you watch them pop off with donations and you see them hit their goals. Where do you think that money goes? Do you think it doesn't go in their pockets? I mean, you're giving it to them. It's not that big of a deal. I was watching um, Charlie, Moist Critical, i.e. Penguin Zero. Uh, I was watching his video on it. He made a lot of good points. And it makes a lot of sense. It's, it's the entertainment industry. Just like uh, how he brought out sports, how he brought out actors, and, and that includes Twitch streamers um, and YouTubers, like anything like that. Instagram models even. You know, they they get fans, they get sponsors for those fans and ads, you know, that they that they read off and, and they get plenty of money from that. So I don't understand why people are so upset about it, honestly. I don't get it. I mean, I work a nine to five job just like most of you out there. I'm not popular on Twitch at all or YouTube. 
I mean, maybe one day I'll get lucky. The chances of that are very, very slim, but you never know. You don't see me complaining. I'm out here and I'm, I'm trying to see what I can do. Just for fun. That's what it's about. And that's how these people started. And that's how they got to where they are because we like watching them. They entertain us and they do it for free. The only reason why uh, they get money from us is because we give it to them. You know, they're putting this content out there for free for our benefit. We don't have to pay a dime, but they do make a living off of it. So for people to be so upset about it and, and as angry as they are and feel betrayed against their favorite YouTubers and Twitch streamers, it's just silly. It's just silly, guys. The, the evidence is plain to see, as was brought out by many people, the sub counts are uh, available to the general public you can see how many subscribers that they have and if you just do even the simplest math with how much sub uh, subs cost then you can easily get a, a, a vague estimate and I mean they pl make plenty more so I mean it's it's been there the whole entire time uh, YouTube may have been a bit more vague because there's not like an active way to to see which is why twitch is a bit different but I mean Come on, guys. We see as these people grow and they get bigger, they upgrade their rigs and their equipment. They get better cameras, better lighting. You see them, you know, get all kinds of things. As they grow, they start off, they don't have very much. They start with cheap stuff like I do. I have cheap things. I don't have very expensive equipment. But, you know... I'll try I try to, to upgrade eventually but that's on my own dime that's not from anything that I'm getting like I'm a nobody right now you know but we see these youtubers and streamers grow from our support watching them and we see them getting new things moving up in the world getting more popular and I mean you watch people like the Paul brothers they've made Tons of money. You see all these YouTubers, Mr. Beast and whatnot, giving away a bunch of money, buying a bunch of things. You know, you can tell that they get a lot of money. So if you're if you're a fan of Mr. Beast and you're also getting angry at the revenue that Twitch streamers make, I'm not saying that's the case. I'm just saying you can't see this stuff for months and months and years on end and be surprised by it. It doesn't make any sense. Anyway, I'm rambling right now but the point is guys the intro for this video was just to obviously be silly this whole situation is blown way out of proportion and people are really upset about it for some reason I know it's been a couple days I know it's gonna be dying down soon but I just kinda wanted to give my two cents on the matter but uh, yeah calm down everyone chill out and have a good day I'll see you all next time take care